We're going to see the adenoma carcinoma sequence for colorectal cancer. We have the APC gene, adenomatous polyposy coli gene. This is a tumor suppressor gene that codifies for the negative regulator of the beta catenin. So, um, we need mutation of the two copies of this gene, adenomatous polyposy coli um, gene. So, the first, first thing is mutation. It will be a mutation on the two copies. Then, the, um, the colon is now colon at risk of developing uh, the adenoma or polyp and then the, the carcinoma. So here we just see head up of the cells. Then when there is a mutation now of the K-RAS, that is the gene that qualifies for a G-RAS protein, then now the patient develops a adenoma or polyp. And lastly, mutation, well, mm, first a mutation on the DCC gene and then mutation on the TP53. TP53 is the gene encoded for P53 and here now the carcinoma. So there is a overexpression of COX2, cyclooxygenase 2 enzyme here that uh, aids on the development of carcinoma. So aspirin that is a inhibitor of uh, cyclooxygenase enzymes is a, a protector um, factor to these patients because they are inhibiting these uh, cyclooxygenase that can progress or make the adenoma progress to carcinoma. So we have APC gene, mutation on the APC gene, then in the CARAS, mutation on the CARAS leads to adenoma or polyp, and then mutation on the DCC gene and TP53.